What's your favorite room in the house, and why? My favorite room is the living room because it's the heart of the house. Perfect for relaxing and spending time with family and friends. What's your favorite room in the house, and why? My favorite room is the living room because it's the heart of the house. Perfect for relaxing and spending time with family and friends. How do you personalize your bedroom to make it feel like your own space? I add personal touches like photos, artwork, and decorations that reflect my personality, creating a cozy and welcoming atmosphere. How do you personalize your bedroom to make it feel like your own space? I add personal touches like photos, artwork, and decorations that reflect my personality, creating a cozy and welcoming atmosphere. Are there specific features in the kitchen that you find essential for your cooking routine? A spacious countertop and good lighting are essential in the kitchen, making meal preparation more enjoyable and efficient. Are there specific features in the kitchen that you find essential for your cooking routine? A spacious countertop and good lighting are essential in the kitchen, making meal preparation more enjoyable and efficient. What's your go-to spot for relaxation in your house? I love unwinding in the backyard. Having a peaceful outdoor space allows me to connect with nature and clear my mind. What's your go-to spot for relaxation in your house? I love unwinding in the backyard. Having a peaceful outdoor space allows me to connect with nature and clear my mind. How do you organize and maintain your closet to make getting dressed easier? I use a color-coded system and keep frequently worn items within easy reach, streamlining the process of choosing outfits. How do you organize and maintain your closet to make getting dressed easier? I use a color-coded system and keep frequently worn items within easy reach, streamlining the process of choosing outfits. Are there specific home decor styles or themes that you're drawn to for your living space? I gravitate towards a modern and minimalist decor style with neutral tones, creating a clean and visually appealing living environment. Are there specific home decor styles or themes that you're drawn to for your living space? I gravitate towards a modern and minimalist decor style with neutral tones. Creating a clean and visually appealing living environment. How do you utilize storage solutions to keep your home organized and clutter free? I invest in storage bins, shelves, and furniture with built in storage to keep belongings organized and maintain a tidy living space. How do you utilize storage solutions to keep your home organized and clutter free? I invest in storage bins, shelves, and furniture with built in storage to keep belongings organized and maintain a tidy living space. What's your preferred lighting setup in different areas of the house? I prefer warm and soft lighting in the living room for a cozy ambiance, while in the study, I prefer bright and focused lighting for better concentration. What's your preferred lighting setup in different areas of the house? 
I prefer warm and soft lighting in the living room for a cozy ambiance. While in the study, I prefer bright and focused lighting for better concentration. How do you make your bathroom a relaxing and spa-like space? I use scented candles, plush towels, and soothing colors to create a spa-like atmosphere in the bathroom for a tranquil experience. How do you make your bathroom a relaxing and spa-like space? I use scented candles, plush towels, and soothing colors to create a spa-like atmosphere in the bathroom for a tranquil experience. Are there specific plants or greenery that you incorporate into your home decor? I love having indoor plants like succulents and snake plants. They not only add a touch of nature but also improve air quality. Are there specific plants or greenery that you incorporate into your home decor? I love having indoor plants like succulents and snake plants. They not only add a touch of nature but also improve air quality. What's your approach to decorating your dining area for family gatherings or special occasions? I use a mix of elegant table settings, tablecloths, and seasonal decorations to create a festive atmosphere for family gatherings and special occasions. What's your approach to decorating your dining area for family gatherings or special occasions? I use a mix of elegant table settings, tablecloths, and seasonal decorations to create a festive atmosphere for family gatherings and special occasions. How do you maintain a functional and organized workspace in your home office or study? I keep my workspace clutter free by using organizers keeping only essential items on the desk, and having a designated spot for each item. How do you maintain a functional and organized workspace in your home office or study? I keep my workspace clutter-free by using organizers, keeping only essential items on the desk, and having a designated spot for each item. Are there specific color schemes that you find calming or energizing for different rooms in the house? I find cool tones like blues and greens calming for the bedroom and common areas, while warm tones like yellows and oranges are energizing for the kitchen. Are there specific color schemes that you find calming or energizing for different rooms in the house? I find cool tones like blues and greens calming for the bedroom and common areas, while warm tones like yellows and oranges are energizing for the kitchen. How do you create a cozy and inviting atmosphere in the living room for movie nights or relaxation? I use plush cushions, throws, and dim lighting to create a cozy atmosphere in the living room, perfect for movie nights and relaxation. How do you create a cozy and inviting atmosphere in the living room for movie nights or relaxation? I use plush cushions, throws, and dim lighting to create a cozy atmosphere in the living room. Perfect for movie nights and relaxation. What's your favorite piece of furniture in your house? And what makes it special to you? My favorite piece of furniture is the vintage coffee table in the living room. It adds character and a touch of nostalgia to the space. What's your favorite piece of furniture in your house? And what makes it special to you? 
My favorite piece of furniture is the vintage coffee table in the living room it adds character and a touch of nostalgia to the space. How do you utilize wall space for both functional and decorative purposes? I use shelves and wall-mounted organizers for functional purposes, and I incorporate artwork and mirrors to enhance the aesthetic appeal of the walls. How do you utilize wall space for both functional and decorative purposes? I use shelves and wall-mounted organizers for functional purposes, and I incorporate artwork and mirrors to enhance the aesthetic appeal of the walls. Are there specific scents or candles that you use to create a pleasant ambiance in your home? I enjoy scents like lavender or vanilla for a calming atmosphere and I use scented candles to add a cozy fragrance to different rooms. Are there specific scents or candles that you use to create a pleasant ambiance in your home? I enjoy scents like lavender or vanilla for a calming atmosphere, and I use scented candles to add a cozy fragrance to different rooms. How do you balance open spaces with more private and intimate areas in your house? I use furniture arrangements and room dividers to create distinct zones, balancing open spaces for socializing with private areas for relaxation. How do you balance open spaces with more private and intimate areas in your house? I use furniture arrangements and room dividers to create distinct zones, balancing open spaces for socializing with private areas for relaxation. What's your approach to maintaining a clean and organized entryway or foyer? I use hooks for coats, a shoe rack for footwear, and a console table with baskets for keys and daily essentials, keeping the entryway tidy and organized. What's your approach to maintaining a clean and organized entryway or foyer? I use hooks for coats, a shoe rack for footwear, and a console table with baskets for keys and daily essentials keeping the entryway tidy and organized. Are there specific features in your home that enhance energy efficiency and sustainability? I use energy-efficient appliances, LED bulbs, and eco-friendly materials in home decor to reduce energy consumption and promote sustainability. Are there specific features in your home that enhance energy efficiency and sustainability? I use energy efficient appliances, LED bulbs, and eco friendly materials in home decor to reduce energy consumption and promote sustainability. How do you create a designated workspace within a shared living environment? I use room dividers, furniture arrangements, and noise-canceling elements to create a dedicated and productive workspace within a shared living space. How do you create a designated workspace within a shared living environment? I use room dividers, furniture arrangements, and noise-canceling elements to create a dedicated and productive workspace within a shared living space. Are there specific home maintenance tasks that you prioritize to keep your house in good condition? Regular tasks like cleaning gutters, checking for leaks, and servicing the HVAC system are priorities to ensure the house remains in good condition. 
Are there specific home maintenance tasks that you prioritize to keep your house in good condition? Regular tasks like cleaning gutters, checking for leaks, and servicing the HVAC system are priorities to ensure the house remains in good condition. What's your preferred seating arrangement in the living room for socializing or entertaining guests? I prefer a combination of sofas and accent chairs arranged in a way that promotes conversation, creating a welcoming space for socializing and entertaining. What's your preferred seating arrangement in the living room for socializing or entertaining guests? I prefer a combination of sofas and accent chairs arranged in a way that promotes conversation, creating a welcoming space for socializing and entertaining. How do you incorporate personal artwork or DIY projects into your home decor? I display personal artwork and DIY projects on walls and shelves adding a unique and sentimental touch to the overall home decor. How do you incorporate personal artwork or DIY projects into your home decor? I display personal artwork and DIY projects on walls and shelves, adding a unique and sentimental touch to the overall home decor. Are there specific window treatments or curtains that you use to enhance privacy and control natural light? I use blackout curtains in the bedroom for privacy and to control sunlight, while in common areas, I prefer sheer curtains to allow natural light. Are there specific window treatments or curtains that you use to enhance privacy and control natural light? I use blackout curtains in the bedroom for privacy and to control sunlight. While in common areas, I prefer sheer curtains to allow natural light. How do you create a child-friendly and safe environment in different areas of your house? I use child-proof locks, soft furnishings, and non-toxic materials to create a safe and child-friendly environment, especially in areas where kids spend time. How do you create a child-friendly and safe environment in different areas of your house? I use child-proof locks, soft furnishings, and non-toxic materials to create a safe and child-friendly environment, especially in areas where kids spend time. What's your strategy for arranging furniture in smaller spaces to maximize functionality and aesthetics? I use multifunctional furniture, prioritize vertical storage solutions and choose a neutral color palette to create an open and spacious feel in smaller spaces. What's your strategy for arranging furniture in smaller spaces to maximize functionality and aesthetics? I use multifunctional furniture, prioritize vertical storage solutions and choose a neutral color palette to create an open and spacious feel in smaller spaces. How do you choose artwork or wall decor that complements the overall theme of a room? I select artwork or wall decor that complements the color scheme and style of the room, adding a cohesive and visually pleasing element. How do you choose artwork or wall decor that complements the overall theme of a room? I select artwork or wall decor that complements the color scheme and style of the room, adding a cohesive and visually pleasing element. 
What's your favorite feature or element in your kitchen? And how do you make the most of it? My favorite feature is the spacious kitchen island. I use it for meal prep, as a dining area, and a social hub during gatherings, maximizing its functionality. What's your favorite feature or element in your kitchen, and how do you make the most of it? My favorite feature is the spacious kitchen island. I use it for meal prep, as a dining area, and a social hub during gatherings, maximizing its functionality. How do you create a cohesive design flow between different rooms in your house? I use a consistent color palette, coordinate furniture, styles, and incorporate common elements like rugs or artwork to create a cohesive design flow throughout the house. How do you create a cohesive design flow between different rooms in your house? I use a consistent color palette, coordinate furniture, styles, and incorporate common elements like rugs or artwork to create a cohesive design flow throughout the house. Are there specific textiles or fabrics that you use to add warmth and comfort to different areas of your home? I use soft and textured fabrics like throw blankets, rugs, and cushions to add warmth and comfort to different areas of my home creating a cozy atmosphere. Are there specific textiles or fabrics that you use to add warmth and comfort to different areas of your home? I use soft and textured fabrics like throw blankets, rugs, and cushions to add warmth and comfort to different areas of my home, creating a cozy atmosphere. What's your strategy for organizing and displaying books or collections in your home? I use bookshelves, wall-mounted shelves, or display cabinets to organize and showcase books or collections, creating a visually appealing and organized display. What's your strategy for organizing and displaying books or collections in your home? I use bookshelves, wall-mounted shelves, or display cabinets to organize and showcase books or collections, creating a visually appealing and organized display. How do you personalize your outdoor space, such as a balcony or patio, to make it an extension of your home? I use outdoor furniture, potted plants, and decorative lighting to create a comfortable and inviting outdoor space that reflects my personal style. How do you personalize your outdoor space, such as a balcony or patio, to make it an extension of your home? I use outdoor furniture, potted plants, and decorative lighting to create a comfortable and inviting outdoor space that reflects my personal style. Are there specific room layouts or arrangements that you find conducive to relaxation and comfort? I prefer open and airy room layouts with comfortable seating arrangements creating a sense of relaxation and comfort in different areas of the house. Are there specific room layouts or arrangements that you find conducive to relaxation and comfort? I prefer open and airy room layouts with comfortable seating arrangements, creating a sense of relaxation and comfort in different areas of the house. How do you choose color schemes for different rooms to evoke specific moods or atmospheres? I choose calming and neutral colors for bedrooms, vibrant and energetic tones for the kitchen, 
and warm and inviting hues for the living room to evoke specific moods. How do you choose color schemes for different rooms to evoke specific moods or atmospheres? I choose calming and neutral colors for bedrooms. Vibrant and energetic tones for the kitchen. And warm and inviting hues for the living room to evoke specific moods. What's your approach to selecting and arranging furniture in a way that maximizes space and functionality? I prioritize multifunctional furniture. Arrange furniture to create clear pathways. And use space-saving solutions to maximize both space and functionality. What's your approach to selecting and arranging furniture in a way that maximizes space and functionality? I prioritize multifunctional furniture. Arrange furniture to create clear pathways. And use space-saving solutions to maximize both space and functionality. How do you utilize outdoor spaces like a backyard or garden to create a retreat for relaxation? I use outdoor furniture, greenery, and ambient lighting to transform outdoor spaces into a retreat for relaxation, making the most of the natural surroundings. How do you utilize outdoor spaces like a backyard or garden to create a retreat for relaxation? I use outdoor furniture, greenery, and ambient lighting to transform outdoor spaces into a retreat for relaxation, making the most of the natural surroundings. What's your preferred method for maintaining a clean and organized kitchen space? I regularly declutter countertops, organize pantry items, and clean appliances to maintain a clean and organized kitchen space for efficient meal preparation. What's your preferred method for maintaining a clean and organized kitchen space? I regularly declutter countertops, organize pantry items, and clean appliances to maintain a clean and organized kitchen space for efficient meal preparation. How do you choose artwork or wall decor for a child's room to foster creativity and imagination? I select colorful and whimsical artwork incorporate themed wall decals, and create a designated art corner to foster creativity and imagination in a child's room. How do you choose artwork or wall decor for a child's room to foster creativity and imagination? I select colorful and whimsical artwork, incorporate themed wall decals, and create a designated art corner to foster creativity and imagination in a child's room. What's your strategy for incorporating smart home technology into different areas of your house? I integrate smart home technology for security systems, lighting control, and energy efficiency enhancing convenience and functionality in different areas of the house. What's your strategy for incorporating smart home technology into different areas of your house? I integrate smart home technology for security systems, lighting control, and energy efficiency. Enhancing convenience and functionality in different areas of the house. How do you create a guest-friendly environment in your home, especially in guest bedrooms or common areas? I provide comfortable bedding, clear storage space, 
and thoughtful touches like fresh flowers to create a welcoming and guest-friendly environment in my home. How do you create a guest-friendly environment in your home, especially in guest bedrooms or common areas? I provide comfortable bedding, clear storage space, and thoughtful touches like fresh flowers to create a welcoming and guest-friendly environment in my home. Are there specific design elements or furniture styles that you find timeless and enduring in your home decor? I appreciate classic furniture styles like mid-century modern or traditional pieces and neutral colors that stand the test of time. Creating a timeless and enduring home decor. Are there specific design elements or furniture styles that you find timeless and enduring in your home decor? I appreciate classic furniture styles like mid-century modern or traditional pieces, and neutral colors that stand the test of time. Creating a timeless and enduring home decor. How do you utilize wall space in your home to display a gallery of family photos or artwork? I create a gallery wall with a mix of family photos and artwork, using frames or floating shelves to arrange them in a visually appealing and meaningful way. How do you utilize wall space in your home to display a gallery of family photos or artwork? I create a gallery wall with a mix of family photos and artwork, using frames or floating shelves to arrange them in a visually appealing and meaningful way. What's your preferred layout or arrangement for a productive and inspiring home office or study? I prefer a clutter-free and organized home office with ample natural light, a comfortable chair, and minimal distractions to create a productive and inspiring workspace. What's your preferred layout or arrangement for a productive and inspiring home office or study? I prefer a clutter-free and organized home office with ample natural light a comfortable chair, and minimal distractions to create a productive and inspiring workspace. How do you choose flooring materials and rugs that balance aesthetics with practicality in different areas of your home? I choose durable and easy-to-clean flooring materials for high-traffic areas. While incorporating area rugs with textures and patterns to balance aesthetics with practicality. How do you choose flooring materials and rugs that balance aesthetics with practicality in different areas of your home? I choose durable and easy to clean flooring materials for high traffic areas. While incorporating area rugs with textures and patterns to balance aesthetics with practicality. What's your approach to incorporating seasonal decor changes in your home throughout the year? I use seasonal decor like throw pillows, blankets, and centerpieces to incorporate subtle changes in color and theme reflecting the seasons throughout the year. What's your approach to incorporating seasonal decor changes in your home throughout the year? I use seasonal decor like throw pillows, blankets, and centerpieces to incorporate subtle changes in color and theme, reflecting the seasons throughout the year. How do you maintain a harmonious design flow in homes with open floor plans and interconnected spaces? I use consistent color schemes, coordinate furniture styles, 
and create visual focal points to maintain a harmonious design flow in homes with open floor plans. How do you maintain a harmonious design flow in homes with open floor plans and interconnected spaces? I use consistent color schemes, coordinate furniture styles, and create visual focal points to maintain a harmonious design flow in homes with open floor plans. Are there specific design elements or furniture pieces that you find essential for creating a cozy reading nook in your home? I include a comfortable chair or reading nook. Soft lighting, and bookshelves filled with favorite reads to create a cozy and inviting space for reading in my home. Are there specific design elements or furniture pieces that you find essential for creating a cozy reading nook in your home? I include a comfortable chair or reading nook soft lighting, and bookshelves filled with favorite reads to create a cozy and inviting space for reading in my home. How do you personalize your bathroom space with accessories and decor to make it uniquely yours? I use decorative towels, soap dispensers, and artwork that align with my personal style adding a touch of personality to the bathroom space. How do you personalize your bathroom space with accessories and decor to make it uniquely yours? I use decorative towels, soap dispensers, and artwork that align with my personal style, adding a touch of personality to the bathroom space. What's your preferred setup for an entertainment center or media room to enhance the viewing experience? I arrange comfortable seating, a quality sound system, and ambient lighting to create an immersive and enjoyable entertainment center or media room setup. What's your preferred setup for an entertainment center or media room to enhance the viewing experience? I arrange comfortable seating, a quality sound system, and ambient lighting to create an immersive and enjoyable entertainment center or media room setup. How do you choose and arrange furniture in a dining room to encourage conversation and connection during meals? I select a dining table that fosters intimacy. Arrange chairs to facilitate conversation, and add ambient lighting to create a warm and inviting dining space. How do you choose and arrange furniture in a dining room to encourage conversation and connection during meals? I select a dining table that fosters intimacy. Arrange chairs to facilitate conversation and add ambient lighting to create a warm and inviting dining space. What's your strategy for organizing a home gym or workout space for convenience and motivation? I use storage solutions for fitness equipment, choose a well-ventilated area with natural light, and incorporate motivational decor to create an organized and inspiring home gym. What's your strategy for organizing a home gym or workout space for convenience and motivation? I use storage solutions for fitness equipment, choose a well-ventilated area with natural light, and incorporate motivational decor to create an organized and inspiring home gym. How do you create a serene and calming atmosphere in a bedroom to promote restful sleep? I choose soothing colors, incorporate soft bedding and blackout curtains, and minimize electronic devices to create a serene and calming bedroom environment for restful sleep. 
How do you create a serene and calming atmosphere in a bedroom to promote restful sleep? I choose soothing colors, incorporate soft bedding and blackout curtains, and minimize electronic devices to create a serene and calming bedroom environment for restful sleep. What's your approach to choosing and arranging furniture in a multi-purpose room to accommodate various activities? I use flexible furniture arrangements, multifunctional pieces, and storage solutions to create a versatile multi-purpose room that accommodates various activities. What's your approach to choosing and arranging furniture in a multi-purpose room to accommodate various activities? I use flexible furniture arrangements, multifunctional pieces, and storage solutions to create a versatile multi-purpose room that accommodates various activities. How do you incorporate technology and automation in the kitchen to enhance efficiency and convenience? I integrate smart appliances, automated lighting, and voice-activated controls to enhance efficiency and convenience in the kitchen. Creating a modern and tech-savvy cooking space. How do you incorporate technology and automation in the kitchen to enhance efficiency and convenience? I integrate smart appliances, automated lighting, and voice-activated controls to enhance efficiency and convenience in the kitchen. Creating a modern and tech-savvy cooking space. What's your preferred color scheme and decor style for a home office to inspire productivity and focus? I prefer a neutral color scheme with pops of energizing colors. Minimalist decor, and functional furniture to create a home office that inspires productivity and focus. What's your preferred color scheme and decor style for a home office to inspire productivity and focus? I prefer a neutral color scheme with pops of energizing colors, minimalist decor, and functional furniture to create a home office that inspires productivity and focus. How do you design and organize a playroom for children that encourages creativity and active play? I use vibrant colors, dedicated play zones, and ample storage for toys to design a playroom that encourages creativity, active play, and organization for children. How do you design and organize a playroom for children that encourages creativity and active play? I use vibrant colors, dedicated play zones, and ample storage for toys to design a playroom that encourages creativity, active play, and organization for children. What's your strategy for incorporating vintage or antique pieces into your home decor for a touch of nostalgia? I carefully select and place vintage or antique pieces as focal points, complementing them with modern elements to create a balanced and nostalgic home decor. What's your strategy for incorporating vintage or antique pieces into your home decor for a touch of nostalgia? I carefully select and place vintage or antique pieces as focal points, complementing them with modern elements to create a balanced and nostalgic home decor. How do you choose and arrange furniture in a shared living space to accommodate diverse preferences and needs? I use a mix of comfortable and flexible furniture. Consider diverse preferences, 
and create designated zones to accommodate various needs in a shared living space. How do you choose and arrange furniture in a shared living space to accommodate diverse preferences and needs? I use a mix of comfortable and flexible furniture. Consider diverse preferences and create designated zones to accommodate various needs in a shared living space. What's your approach to designing a pet-friendly home that balances style with practicality? I choose durable and easy-to-clean materials. Incorporate pet-friendly furniture and create designated pet areas to balance style with practicality in a pet-friendly home. What's your approach to designing a pet-friendly home that balances style with practicality? I choose durable and easy-to-clean materials. Incorporate pet-friendly furniture and create designated pet areas to balance style with practicality in a pet-friendly home. How do you create an inspiring and organized craft or hobby room with dedicated storage for supplies? I use open shelving, storage containers, and labeled drawers to organize craft supplies. Creating an inspiring and organized craft or hobby room with dedicated storage. How do you create an inspiring and organized craft or hobby room with dedicated storage for supplies? I use open shelving, storage containers, and labeled drawers to organize craft supplies. Creating an inspiring and organized craft or hobby room with dedicated storage. What's your preferred layout and decor style for a cozy and intimate living room for family gatherings? I prefer a layout with comfortable seating arrangements, warm colors, and soft textures creating a cozy and intimate living room perfect for family gatherings. What's your preferred layout and decor style for a cozy and intimate living room for family gatherings? I prefer a layout with comfortable seating arrangements, warm colors, and soft textures, creating a cozy and intimate living room perfect for family gatherings.